What's good, Fluffle? It's time for Deno Forte 3. Thought I forgot, didn't you? Recap. Last thing we knew, the station manager, the station manager, I was gonna say owner, but that's not the right title, was on the deadliner with a mysterious silver lockbox that was glowing golden. He was there because Ryotaro requested information about Yuta and why the Imagins are attacking. You know, all sorts of what the fuck is going on information about the situation. That brings us to this episode. With the preview we saw last time, the station manager apparently does not think that Yuto is the key to the new line. Emotions seem to flare up because Ryotaro does not want the Imagine to fight with him anymore. Why? That's why you're here, isn't it? To find that out. How about I stop the gabbing and just hop on in? What's in the box? It can't be! But it is! Spoons. 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 No. No, it's not. Goofy. What about the more important life-altering timeline-changing crap? Thank you. Hi. Naomi, you don't even like your own coffee. Why do you keep serving it? What is he doing? What the? How'd you do that? Meanwhile, on top of some random-ass rooftop. Because he has a checkpoint system, you idiot. It's winter? That's weird to you? What are you doing today? And how are you doing that? What the fuck was that? Bro, that was bullshit. I need an explanation about you. Of course there's more to it, with seven to six episodes left. The spoon? Hmm. No one accounts for him. But Ryo Taro, does he only remember because he's a singularity point, or is there something more? Are you from a different world? I see what he means. That would be a very interesting concept. That'd be a twist. Maybe that timeline was destroyed? But if it was, this Ari wouldn't be so spacey and the Milk Dipper would be the Library Cafe. Isn't that proof enough? What about the telescope? Isn't that proof? 
Meanwhile, with Yuto. I mean, isn't that proof? Like, what is the station master trying to say? Isn't Yuto proof? Him feeling some sort of way about Ari knowing that's his future fiance, but weird Amajin shit happened and is sort of preventing it. What the whole fuck? You're doing it again? Dude! Woo! What the hell? What sort of wish is that? He's interpreting that wrong, right? Okay. Oh, it's just an idiot. Why do you sound like Okayasu from JoJo? That's true. Unless he cuts off your head, but you still might even feel it? What the hell? He didn't cut him? What's happening here? Momotaros, why do you wear two pairs of jeans? So you can sag with one pair and don't have to see your underwear? Hmm... Really? No! You should be talking! You have a time-traveling train! Stay here and talk for a second! The buildings haven't started disappearing! Is he baiting you? I uh, don't do that. How do you just do that? <laughs> and here comes the writer's despair. <laughs> is that circumstance? Is that cause and effect? Or is that your wish? Damn. He got him good. The Imagine will disappear from your year, and everything will be safe, but you've made friends with them. June 25th, 2005. And then a monster pops out of him. True story. Yeah. I think you guys are the ones that's gonna pay. And everyone else. Dude, what are you based off of? You've got some sort of horn on your hand, you've got a ball and a chain, and then you've got a spiked ball as a shoulder pad, and there's these studs everywhere. Are... Are you a rhino and that's your horn? That's my guess. It's a blue rhino. If you don't fight, other things will disappear. Yup. People and buildings and lives. Hmm. <sighs> Connect that train, cuz. Let's go.
All right, Rio. It's probably around the time where he says he doesn't want them to fight with him anymore. There you go. Good job, man. Rio. You picked the worst time to do this. Rio. Okay, but how are you going to finish it now? I get why you're feeling this way, but that was a really dumbass decision. Mm. I'm sorry you're mentally conflicted. I am not sorry that you're getting physically beat. Because that was a very dumbass choice. Oh look, it's Pocket Watch! Rio! Get up, Nogami! Oh. Thank you, Zero Nose. What? Rio Taro is the key? Did Sakura Yuto do all of this for Rio Taro? Mm. Not a three-piece with the horn hand. He's not going to do it. How do you not get hurt by the thumper? The thumper fucking thumps. That's in its name. It's supposed to thump you. You can't just shrug off a thump. That's not it. Come on, man! This is one Imagine. You're you're acting like you're 99% of the way done, but you don't want the 100%. You're like 70% done. There's some wiggle room there. Just finish it. Can Deneb ungun and help? Whew. And they're gone. Did he... Did it get on? Is it there? It sure the fuck doesn't. No, no. Yuto did all that work. For, for, for Ryo to get thumped? No. No, he's justified. As the one who can disappear, he has every right to be mad about how he wants to disappear or not. And Ryo's trying to fuck it up. Getting himself hurt in the process. I completely agree with these two. I'm disappointed in you. Then how are you gonna fight, idiot? Oh, fantastic. It is on. Can you even open the door? You don't have a train pass. And it's in motion. How are you that strong? You did not just say those words. Dude.
Well, that was a, um, very emotionally charged episode. For Ryotaro to say those words to his Amajin friends after all that time. That is... heartbreaking. They're most likely gonna get past this, but I don't know. We're at the ending now. He could semi-successfully fight in liner form without a weapon. I don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen next. What is the deal with Ryotaro being the only one who remembers the past timeline? What is Sakurai Yuto really doing? If he's not the key to the junction point, but he's always in the past watching Ryo and protecting Ryo, is it him? Is Ryo Taro Nogami the key to the junction point? The fuck is going on? Got a few more episodes left, though. We just gotta stick with it and hope they reveal it. And if they don't, well, this would have been a giant waste of time. <laughs> if you enjoyed this react as much as I enjoyed making it, be sure to cast that like and that comment on the video, as well as subscribing to the channel for more. I'll see you guys next time.